subscribe and download over 1 million code snippet including this tutorial from codegive.com, link in the description below. Certainly. In web development, cross-site request forgery, CSRF, is an attack that tricks the victim into submitting a malicious request. Many web applications use CSRF tokens to protect against such attacks. In this tutorial, we'll explore how to use the Python requests library to perform a GET request and obtain a CSRF token from a website. Make sure you have Python and the requests library installed. You can install requests using. In this example, we're also using beautiful soup for HTML parsing. If you don't have it installed, you can install it using replace https colon slash slash example.com with the URL of the website you're working with. Inspect the source code of the web page to find the HTML element containing the CSRF token. It's usually found in a form element. For example, Replace CSRF underscore token with the actual name attribute of the input field containing the CSRF token. This example assumes that the CSRF token is present in the HTML source code as a hidden input field. Adapt the code based on the structure of the website you're working with. Additionally, note that some websites might use JavaScript to load or manipulate the CSRF token, and this basic example might not cover those cases. ChatGPT